हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टूडेज टॉपिक इज प्रोडक्शन फंक्शन सो दिस टेबल शोज दैट हाउ द क्वांटिटी ऑफ कुकीज प्रोड्यूस्ड पर आर डिपेंड्स अपॉन द नंबर ऑफ वर्कर्स सो एस यू कैन सी दैट वन द नंबर ऑफ वर्कर इज जीरो द क्वांटिटी ऑफ कुकीज प्रोड्यूस्ड इज जीरो when number of worker uh, is 1 quantity produced or or the quantity of cookies produced is 50 when the number of workers uh, increase to 2 the quantity of cookies produced per hour is 90 and so on when we will uh, plot these two combinations as you can see on the horizontal axis we have taken number of workers hired and on the vertical axis we have taken quantity of output cookies per hour okay so when we will plot these uh, combinations that were given in the table what we will get we will get the production function production function this relationship between the quantity of inputs in our case workers and quantity of output which is cookies is called the production function so the relationship between the quantity of input and quantity of output is called the production function okay next we will look at this uh, third column which is marginal product of labor the marginal product of any input is the in, uh, of of any input in the production process is the increase in the quantity of output obtained from one additional unit of that input marginal ka matlab hi kya hota hai marginal ka matlab hota hai change okay to wahi aap se keh raha hai ki agar hame marginal product nikalna hai kisi bhi input ka to hum kaise nikalenge change in the quantity of output divided by or you can say marginal product is change in quantity of output due to change in quantity of input okay this is marginal product so as you can see that uh, when the number of worker increases from 1 to 2 the quantity of output is increased from 50 to 90 so the change will be 40 right marginal product of labor will be 40 when the number of worker increase from 2 to 3 the quantity of output increase from 90 to 120 so the change is 30 120 minus 90 okay when the number of worker increase from 3 to 4 uh the the quantity of cookies produced increase from 120 to 140 so the change is 20 notice as the number of worker increases the marginal product declines to hum ye bhi ek observe kar sakte hain yahan par that uh, as the number of workers are increasing from 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 the marginal product of labor is continuously declining okay 50 40 30 20 this property is called the diminishing marginal product so this property ko hum bolte hain diminishing marginal product at first when only a few workers are hired they have easy access to the carlins kitchen equipment as the number of worker increases additional workers have to share equipment and work in more crowded conditions and eventually the kitchen is so crowded that the workers start getting in each other's way and that is a reason hence as more and more workers are hired each additional worker contributes fewer additional cookies to the total production to yahi iska matlab jo main conclusion hai wo yahi hai that as the number of workers 
as the number of workers increases marginal product marginal product of worker or labor will decrease their contribution to the total production will be reduced or decreased the production function slope that is rise over run tells us the change in carolin's output of cookies which is rise for each additional unit of labor that is run see jab hum slope find out karte hain to slope ka kya formula hota hai rise upon run okay to wahi yahan pe likh raha hai aur hamare case mein agar hum baat kare to kehne ka matlab hai change in quantity of output that is cookies upon change in quantity of input ab aapko yaad hoga ye formula kiska hota hai ye formula hai marginal product ka right marginal product hamare case mein marginal jo factor hai that is labor so we will write marginal product of labor and that is the reason it is written that slope of the production function measures the marginal product of a worker jo slope hai wo measure karta hai marginal product of worker so <clears throat> as you can see in this figure that uh, when the number of worker increased from 1 to 2 okay the the output is increased from 50 to 90 okay so this is run and this is rise rise over run theek hai ab yahan pe rise kitna hai agar main dekhu it is uh, 50 to 90 which is 40 right and iska change kitna tha 2 minus 1 which is 1 so the slope will be slope is 40 right 40 upon 1 theek hai aise hi aap chahe to kisi aur point ka bhi aap calculate kar sakte hain for example yahan par agar hum dekhe hmm okay so this is run and this is rise ठीक है, सो स्लोप विल बी ट्वेंटी अपॉन वन विच इज Twenty. As the number of worker increases, marginal product declines, and the production function becomes flatter. Okay, so one thing we have understood is that slope of production function. Production function's slope is what? Production function's slope is your marginal marginal product. मार्जल प्रोडक्ट का फॉर्मूला हम लोग देख चुके हैं राइट चेंज इन क्वांटिटी ऑफ आउटपुट चेंज इन क्वांटिटी ऑफ आउटपुट अपॉन चेंज इन क्वांटिटी ऑफ इनपुट राइट so basically they are saying that as the number of worker increases for example uh, uh, when the number of worker increase from 1 to 2 what is the marginal product of the second worker if we see the slope it's 50 to 90 which is uh, 40 right when the number of worker increase from 2 to 3 okay 2 to 3 so the marginal product of the uh, third worker is it's 90 to 120 which is 30 okay when the number of worker increased from 3 to 
the additional contribution by the fourth worker is 20 right so as you can see that as the number of worker increases their contribution is continuously declining 40 30 20 the slope is declining and that is the reason the production function is becoming is is, uh, is becoming flatter okay slope is continuously declining and production function is becoming flatter as the number of worker increases product the slope that is the marginal product declines and production function becomes flatter okay so that's it from my side thank you